And right here in the Tri-Cities, a family has opened up a safe place where anyone can go if they're feeling overwhelmed or stressed out during the pandemic. Cap KV's Madeline Hagen has this family's story, and we do want to warn you that this story could be hard for some people to watch. I miss his hugs. He, he was an incredible hugger. And he was so kind to people, and he just had that free spirit about him that when he walked into the room, you could feel the love that came out of that kid. Care, helping, inspire, love, live. The words Kess Brown's parents have turned to in their darkest days. We just decided that we wanted to focus on something a little more positive and helping people much further down the road so that it doesn't get to the place where, where we ended up as a family. In December of 2018, 19-year-old Kess Brown died by suicide. His parents, Annie and Terry, say they never thought the man who helped everyone needed help himself. It was part of who he was. He always took care of everybody else. Born from the devastation of loss is Chill Encounter, a place where anyone can unwind in a massage chair and escape to a different place through virtual reality. This is a great way in under 30 minutes that people can disconnect. Our focus is solely on mental wellness and healthy families. Their other goal, prevention and talking openly about suicide. And I urge this, that parents have the discussion with their kids. They talk about how are you feeling, you know, and mental wellness. Amidst the heat lamps and VR sets are two parents on a mission, remembering their son and encouraging others to take care of their mental health. Do you feel cussed with you? Oh, yeah. yeah, 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 all the time, all the time. You know, the soul and the spirit never dies. They're, they're still with us even though we're in heaven. Absolutely. For Cap KV Local News, I'm Madeline Hagen.